As you wake up to the bird song and dawn warmth, my darling child, I'm with you every minute. With each grin, laugh, and act of compassion toward another, it is as if I am unveiling a new day to you. I am filled with joy when I see the love you have in your heart. Just as in this video, keep in mind, my kid, that there is never a lonely step when you trust in God. I have breathed life into you, and every breath you take is proof of that. To find out whether you are associated with... I am the one who constantly brings to mind the wonder of existence. Whenever you sit quietly and take in the splendor of nature, or immerse yourself in music or literature, God, when you achieve a goal you've set for yourself, or conquer a fear, I will be there to share in your joy and celebrate with you. Your courage and perseverance inspire me, and I will be there to cheer you on as you stand strong. In the same way, I will be there for you when you fall and cry out in defeat. When you're disoriented and by yourself, it... Amen. If you have faith in Jesus, I am the voice inside you that says you can overcome this challenge. I am the one who helps you get back up, dusts you off, and tells you to keep going. If you find yourself tossing and turning in sleep from dread and anxiety, know that you can get back up. Your anxious mind may finally relax, because I am here, the quiet comforter. My love is like the moonlight, a lovely light. A lovely light that envelops you, dispelling darkness and bringing tranquility. It is I who stirs your soul while you daydream about your life's meaning and destiny. You may trust that I will be your guiding light and compass as you bravely make your way through life. I am urging you to love your neighbor as yourself when you see the best in them. When you feel empathy and compassion, please, God. When you look at the intricate details of a flower, the grandeur of a mountain, or the vastness of the sea through the eyes of a kid who loves God, Jesus, you are reflecting my presence in you and demonstrating my creation. The magnificence of nature envelops you. My creations all around you a continual testimony to my all-knowing presence. I will be by your side every step of the way as you seek knowledge and wisdom, even when you question and doubt yourself. I am the one who inspires you to seek out new knowledge and new discoveries. As you seek knowledge, I will be at your side, encouraging your interest and showing you the way. Plus, I'll be there with you when you finally shut your eyes for the night and give in to your fantasies. My love envelopes you as I hold you close, and I am the one who keeps an eye on you. When you sleep, press the Ammon button. If you rely on God's plan at all times, my beloved child, I am by your side. No matter where you are or what you're doing, you can always count on my unwavering presence. Whether it's the usual or the remarkable, the mundane or the joyful, the permitted or the painful, I am present. You are my darling, and I am here for you always. I will never leave your side, and I will never stop loving you. So keep this in mind, my darling. I am with you, keeping watch in every second, in every breath. You appreciate me, my darling. Achieving material wealth is not the only measure of success. While material wealth and social standing might make people feel secure, they are far from being the be, all and end, all of success. For my kid to succeed in life, he or she must have love and meaningful purpose. I say yes to joining God on his journey every morning as I get ready to face the day with enthusiasm and a desire to make a difference in my own special manner. When you discover a job that does more than simply pay the bills, 
it really makes your heart sing. Financial stability, but also the freedom to pursue your artistic interests. Success comes from surrounding yourself with genuine people who accept you for who you are and who will cheer you on when you succeed and console you when you fall. When someone is there to listen and provide comfort at any hour of the night, it is a sign of accomplishment. That is achievement. Developing a healthy self-image via self-care, accepting one's imperfections while praising one's virtues. When you love yourself first and foremost, regardless of it is a compliment on your success. Your faults, that is. Yes. I believe in God when I see people working to improve the world by sharing what they have and lending a helping hand to others who are less fortunate. Turning your benefits into blessings for others is the true measure of accomplishment when you have little but offer much. Facing your anxieties, stepping out of your comfort zone, and choosing bravery above comfort are all signs of success. Embracing difficulties is the key to success. If you're willing to take a risk, you can achieve great things. When you treat everyone you encounter with compassion and respect, Regardless of their rank or background, you are risking your success for something you believe in. The key to success is learning to listen more than to talk, to put yourself in another person's shoes before trying to comprehend them. When you can find happiness in the little things in life, like a gorgeous sunset, a delicious dinner, a friendly hawk, and a nice laugh, you have succeeded. Success comes from appreciating what you have rather than dwelling on what you lack and from making time to savor and be really present in these times. Gratitude for the bounty around you and seeing each day as a gift constitutes success. Being able to freely express your ideas and feelings without worrying about what others may think is a true measure of success. When you embrace your actual self and live truly, that is success. Attaining that state of accomplishment requires forgiving and releasing. When you choose love over hatred and choose peace over conflict, that is when you achieve success. When you mend old wounds, type them in to claim it. When you love and are loved by others, when you live your life with the people that mean the most to you, and when you release your heart from the shackles of your past, that is success. When you establish connections with others that are characterized by love, respect, and trust, you have achieved success. If your life has inspired others to live their best lives and make a good difference in the world, then your legacy will be a success. Leaves a slightly more favorable impression than when you started. Success comes when you tune out the world and tune into your own voice. When you achieve inner calm, success comes when you establish a connection with the holy energy inside you and recognize your unity with everything in creation. Success, my darling child, is not measured in welfare benefits, but in the joy and fulfillment that come from loving and being loved. Amen. The point if you agree, is to develop personally and professionally, to have a positive impact, to stay authentic, and my darling, the definition of success is being able to have a good impact on the world. Success is waiting around the corner at every opportunity I provide to you. Opportunities to learn, develop, and thrive in ways that connect with your soul abound not only in terms of money, benefits, or prestige elevation, but in all aspects of life. Possible new employment or business opportunities await you at the door. I open for you. Making money isn't the only goal. Developing your abilities, getting work experience, and finding your niche are all as important. The potential for introspection and development is inherent in any endeavor you pursue. If you're lucky, some doors will open to a world of new connections. 
the potential for profound pleasure. Camaraderie, learning, and progress is inherent in the relationships you make with others, whether they be friends, mentors, partners, or even complete strangers who teach you life, altering insight. Simply experiencing the love that these partnerships provide and receive is a triumph. On the other hand, certain doors may seem to head into the shadows, forcing you to confront challenging problems or difficulties in your life. But always keep in mind that they are not obstacles, but opportunities for growth. You learn the importance of hope, patience, and persistence from these experiences, which also impart the promise of strength and resilience. Which also impart the promise of strength and resilience. Success is achieved when one emerges from adversity with more strength and wisdom. Sometimes, opportunities present themselves that push you to leave your comfort zone. Perhaps, it's an invitation to go on an exciting journey into uncharted territory. The prospect of fresh adventures lies in these openings. Widen viewpoints and experience the exhilaration of exploration with every fleeting step into uncharted realms. A door may open into a chamber of contemplation and introspection at times. It's a call to seek knowledge of oneself make peace with one's history, and mend one's emotional scars. A lovely achievement is when you can type Amen to declare that you have found inner peace and acceptance. There will be opportunities that present themselves as doorways, leading to realms of hope and desire. I am urging you to follow your heart and make your goals a reality. There are doors that lead you into the realm of service and giving opportunities to make a difference. Share your gifts with the world. Touch lives, spread love and kindness, and every dream you dare to chase and aspiration you strive for is a victory of your spirit and a testament to your success. A wonderful achievement that shines from your spirit. My kid is the pleasure of giving and the contentment that comes from helping others. Additionally, there are openings for doors. Ordinary, daily things, like a new day, a flower in bloom, a child's giggles, or the embrace of a loved one. That promise happiness, love, and tranquility. The key to a rich and fulfilling life is learning to appreciate these times so that you may experience them to the fullest. Keep in mind, my kid, that the journey, not the destination, is what matters most in achieving success. It's about the people you meet, the decisions you make, the challenges you face, the strength you muster, the love you feel, and the life you lead. For you, every door that I open has chance to achieve in these ways. So when doors open, don't be afraid to move forward confidently. Seize the possibilities they provide and revel in the triumphs that lie ahead. In the end, I want you to know that every opportunity I provide you is a chance to improve yourself and learn to appreciate life more. That is the real guarantee of prosperity. My darling kid of prosperity, my darling kid. Claim God's gift by typing, Amen. Whether your objectives are large or small, accomplishing them could be considered a success. Achieving your goals brings you one step closer to being the person you want to be. Make every success you achieve, no matter how little, a reflection of your abilities and the resolve in your soul. Think about the little seeds you sow in the ground. Each one represents an aspiration that you tend to with care, dedication, and watering. You soak them in the sunshine of your unshakable faith that you are paving the way to success. When the first sprout pokes through the soil and soaks up the light, it's a tiny but significant victory. Even something as basic as reading. Uh, if you commit to reading one book every month, you will grow intellectually, emotionally, and spiritually. 
With each turn of the page, at the end of the book, you will have accomplished more than just reading. You will have accomplished a goal that will nourish your intellect and soul. Alternatively, you could aim to write a letter of gratitude every week, in which case you would not only brighten someone's day, but also foster an attitude of gratitude within yourself. Yeah, seeing the stack of letters you've written. It's a quiet success that has fed your heart and enhanced your connections. More ambitious plans may include things like launching a company or completing a marathon. Crossing the finish line is a wonderful achievement, not because of the medal around your neck, but because of the stronger person you have become. A result of training for the marathon, which involves pushing your physical and mental limitations. As a new company owner, you can encounter difficulties, but you develop as an entrepreneur and a person with each difficulty you resolve, risk you take, and failure you overcome. Your perseverance, imagination, and vision are rewarded when your company takes off. Goals that lead you on an inner journey include things like finding inner peace, healing from previous injuries, and loving and accepting yourself more. These aren't the kinds of things you can track with the usual metrics, but when you finally get your head on straight, but when you finally get your head on straight, success is life. Altering when you forgive more deeply and love yourself. Just type a man to get it. Some examples of goals include planting a tree, learning a new language, baking a cake, meeting new friends, forgiving someone, facing your fears, or following your dreams. The bravery to go for a goal is what matters most, no matter how big or little it is. Perseverance in sticking with it, together with the pleasure and development you experienced along the way, develops you, strengthens your character, and enriches your life. Every goal, no matter how great or tiny, is a success. These victories are the brushstrokes that make up your life's masterpiece, the notes that fill in the gaps. So keep in mind, my darling, that success isn't necessarily about receiving accolades or becoming famous. It's about establishing objectives that are in line with your beliefs and interests, working tirelessly to achieve them and relishing in every triumph. No matter how minor, the most authentic definition of success is the contentment you get from completing your path, the self-improvement you undergo, and the love, and the love, and the love, and every emotion, joy, grief, suffering, and love that you experience, my beautiful child, is a part of who you are and what makes you successful rather than sitting on the sidelines and watching your trip unfold. I am right there with you, holding your hand the whole while. Please, God, in moments of sadness, when you may feel like a solitary tree beaten by the tempest, please know that I am by your side. You may rely on my unassuming power to keep you steady. My voice carries the hope of a rainbow after the storm as I murmur among the rustling leaves. It's okay to cry and to feel what you're feeling. And I'll be by your side through the storm while you weep, assisting you in your healing process. I want you to know that I am right there with you when your joy is overflowing in the joy that radiates from you, in the glimmer in your eyes and in the sound of your laughing. I am here. In your joyful song, I am the music. Even if you're hurting, the beat of your joyful dance makes my delight grow a thousand times stronger, my darling. When life becomes tough and the stresses are too much, I am here to quietly ease your pain. Rest assured, I'm at your side, shouldering the burden. I am the bomb that calms your pain and scars, the light that leads you through the darkest hours. When you love, I will be there to support you through the pregnancy and the birth of my kid. With each heartbeat, I am at your side. With each loving expression you make, I am there. 
with each gentle caress you provide. In the generosity you provide, I am present. You show your love by forgiving. In the face of adversity, my kid is a symbol of my love for you. Being brave is what I am. Type M in to claim the power of hope and resilience that I am. The one who helps you persist and bounce back. I will be right there with you, supporting you and proud of the resilience you display in overcoming every obstacle, fear and struggle that comes your way. I am here to see your victory. I am the source of your happiness and pride that fills your heart. With each milestone you clear, every ambition you fulfill, and every victory you relish. In it, I share in your happiness and celebrate with you your success. Whenever you feel like you can't go on, when you can't see a clear path ahead, when anxiety and worry take over, I will be there to support you. I am the hope that motivates you to keep going, the self-assurance that tells you you're valuable. This is necessary for Type of Men 1. My faith can cast out the darkness of your uncertainties when you take time to contemplate quietly. My child, when you need guidance in the quiet of your spirit, I am here to listen. I am the knowledge that shows you the way, the gut feeling that gets you to relax and let go. My kid is the painter. Where I express my love and support for you, my child, is in seeing the seed I placed in you develop into a beautiful flower. For all the knowledge you acquire, every ability you hone, and every ability you hone, and every insight you develop, I am at your side. With each breath, with each heartbeat, with each thought, with each thought, with each emotion, and with each step you take, I am there. You have my unwavering support through thick and thin. My darling, through every moment of your life's ups and downs, triumphs and losses, moments of quiet reflection and raucous revelry. Through thick and thin, I stand by your side. Since I am constantly at your side, thus you will never really be alone while you're not paying attention. When you grieve me, I will bring you comfort. Your mind is amused by my beautiful fantasies. Revitalize your body with this rejuvenating treatment. While you sleep, I am at your side, bringing you peace, rejuvenation, and protection. Give this movie a thumbs up if you want God to bless you in all your endeavors, no matter how big or little, and in all the lessons you encounter. No matter where you go, my protective watchdog will be there. In that place, you will find my shield, my voice, and my blessings. I am not an impartial bystander. Rather, I am your beloved companion, sharing in all that you do, breathing, walking, and living. My protective love envelops you with each breath, my little child. Be at peace knowing this, and come to me when you need me. Be confident, courageous, and at ease as you navigate life because you know this. Realize this and let my love strengthen you, elevate you, and change you. I am with you every breath. In the midst of all our troubles, my love surrounds you like a shield, and God is with us always. By our side, I will never leave you nor forsake you, demonstrates that God's love for his people is eternal and unchangeable. God is on my side. When times are tough or we fall short, God is still there for us. His love for us is not based on our performance or whether we live up to particular expectations, but it is unwavering and unconditional. I will never abandon you, declares God. This implies that no matter what happens or what we go through in life, He is always at our side sharing both the good times and the bad. Just because we don't sense or acknowledge his presence doesn't imply he isn't claiming it. Pipe amen. His existence is as certain as the oxygen we inhale and as steady as our own pulse. Nor forsake you 
is an equally significant second half of the vow. Forsaking someone is giving up on them, leaving them high and dry. According to God, he has no intention of doing any of these things. He will continue to support us through thick and thin, through thick and thin. He will never leave us or forsake us. His love for us will last forever. My darling, with each breath, my protective shield envelops you. I am your unending shield of love and safety. Standing by your side, no matter where you are or what you're doing, imagine your life as an adventure through an enormous, uncharted jungle. I will be your North Star as you go through these woods. I am the beacon of hope that shines through the beacon of hope that shines through the... As the sunbeams from the trees guide your way, I am the uplifting melody of birdsong that motivates you to seize the blessings bestowed upon you by God. I am the soft wind that kisses your cheeks. Goodbye. Whenever you open your eyes in the morning, I am right there with you, directing you, soothing you, and being by your side the whole way. As the first ray of sunshine to touch your face, I am like a breath of fresh air that welcomes you. In the midst of your grief, I am the tranquility that sets the stage for an optimistic, loving day. Every time you open your eyes, I am the gentle murmur that calls to memory your... I am the unseen hand that directs your steps as you carry out your everyday duties and obligations. I am worthy of your power and potential. When you seek my counsel, when you seek my counsel, you will be able to make wise choices. As long as you have faith in God's timetable, I will be by your side through every difficulty you face, every accomplishment you reach, and every encounter you have with other people. Your creativity will be your source of inspiration, and your patience will be your strength. When you love, I am there to fill your heart. Your words of love and compassion find me. Your deeds, the forgiveness inside you, the friendships you build, the love you offer, the compassion you share, my protecting love is always at your side, growing your connections, bringing peace and kindness, even when you're alone. Being with me is like having a warm blanket wrapped around you. I am the tranquility that calms your thoughts, the tranquility that envelops your soul, the kind of acceptance that mends broken spirits, a haven for introspection, self, love and personal development. My loving guard encircles you while you're alone. When sadness comes knocking, I am the one who comfort that dries your eyes. I am the fortitude that keeps you going, the optimism that tells you to keep going. While joy fills your heart, my love is there to comfort, soothe and heal you from the wounds you've sustained with every tear you shed, anguish you experience and loss you've endured. I am the joy that magnifies your joy. In every grin you wear, every laugh you share, and every delight you celebrate, I am the thankfulness that increases your joy and the love that increases your happiness. My darling child, a loving guard is here to magnify your delight, rejoice in your happiness, and make your heart dance. You are like a ship plowing through uncharted seas on your voyage through life. The vast and breathtaking waters of existence may be just as stormy and difficult at times. There will be calm periods, but there will also be moments of strong winds and large waves. No matter how difficult things become, know that you have companions on this path. No matter what the waves of life throw at you, I will be right there to assist you in swimming. You are like a ship setting sail for the first time as you embark on your trip. The vast expanse of the ocean is before you, brimming with possibilities, escapades, and encounters. Your sails are revitalized and optimistic 
and you're brimming with enthusiasm as you set sail, you will find placid waters when you speak loudly. These are the times when you felt the most content, joyful and at peace with yourself. The peacefulness, the blue sky and the light wind all appeal to you. Enjoying the splendor of your surroundings, you hold onto these moments. At these times, you may count on me to be by your side, bringing you happiness and providing the fortitude to hold onto these gifts. Life is full of obstacles, and there will be moments when you have to contend with powerful winds and seas. Let us rejoice in taking part in God's adventure, even if we may falter along the way. In the face of setbacks, disappointments, and losses, you must bear in mind that adversity does not exist to destroy you, but to fortify you. It is during these stormy times that you learn to persevere, be resilient, and appreciate hope. In these dark hours, I am the beacon that will lead you safely through the storm and the waves. You can possibly experience foggy weather on your travels, moments of perplexity, uncertainty, or doubt. I am here to be your compass, leading you in the correct way and assisting you in making the right choices when you are confused about where you are going or when you can't see clearly what is ahead. During these times, there will also be moments when you feel completely lost and confused. Being stuck in a rut is demoralizing and annoying. I have faith in God's plan but it's important to remember that even the most well-oiled ship needs a break once in a while. Taking breaks like this can help you recharge and improve. I am the rock that will keep you from rocking and will let you relax so you can recharge and be ready for the next adventure. Traveling alone is a real possibility at times, no matter how much you want for company or miss the people you care about. No, that you are never really alone. As you journey through life, your faithful friend remains by your side every step of the way, offering solace and company and never missing a beat. Along with new places come new experiences. They stand for chances to learn and develop, to expand your horizons and to find more of who you are in the process of exploring these uncharted regions. In the name of Jesus Christ, I am with you every step of the way, directing your paths as you seek knowledge, sharing in your joy at what you find, and ultimately leading you to a place of profound fulfillment. Remember that with every end comes a new beginning. Even the ship's greenery will eventually die. Your trip comes to an end, but a new one begins, and I will be by your side to welcome you into this new adventure and to lead you on your next voyage. Your life's voyage is like a ship plunging over immense seas, my little kid. There will be sunny days and cloudy nights, peaceful seas and violent storms, happy times and sad times. But no matter what, always keep in mind that I am there for you at all times, offering guidance, love and protection. Your life your aspirations and your potential are on board, and I will be by your side every step of the way. A reliable beacon, a trustworthy compass, and a solid anchor as you navigate this enormous ocean from one crest to the next, through every storm and into every horizon. They are at your side. Amen. Set sail on your great trip with bravery, optimism, and trust, my child. I am by your side every step of the way. I am there in the joy. If you have the belief in heavenly beings, my beloved child, in the laughter that arises from the depths of your being during times of joy and in the tears that fall during times of sorrow, each emotion and feeling you have is a reflection of the exquisiteness of being human. I am by your side during each and every one of these moments when your heart is full of light and your spirit is elevated, a reflection of your excitement, satisfaction, and enjoyment, 
Your laughter is a symphony that provides enormous joy to my heart, my darling. Never fear. I will be by your side whenever you are weak, exhausted, and discouraged. By my side, you will find support, strength, and the ability to go on in your quest. I am here to support you, give you bravery, and give you hope when situations are tough, so long as you have faith in God's power. If you ever feel that you can't handle the challenges life throws at you, just know that I'm always by your side. When you need me, I will quiet the storm, assuage your concerns, and restore harmony to your... I am the place you may find solace and safety while you are going through tough circumstances. Like the sun rising after a dark night, come soul joy after your time of mourning. Your tears now will plant the seeds of happiness tomorrow. So, my darling child, when life's challenges drive you to your knees as your tears fall, do not despair. Instead, seek consolation in me, because I am there to wipe away your tears and to hug you firmly. It will shower down like rain. Keep in mind what I said. If you ever need someone to comfort you, someone to hold you close, someone to wipe away your tears, I will be here. Whether you're experiencing joy, grief, hardships, or successes, know that I am with you every step of the way. Sure, I can be there. My God, I adore you and am here to provide solace, defend you, and love you as a father would. Hence be of good cheer, cling to hope, and trust in my word. For I am here with you always, prepared to dry your tears and hug you close. Constant companionship, your affectionate, lovely child, my comforter, our dreams are the manifestation of our innermost goals, ambitions, and hopes. The skies resound with its ring, a pure and lovely melody that echoes the depths of your joyful spirit. In the moments of pleasure that you experience, I am there to see your eyes light up with excitement your heart flutter with happiness, and your soul soar with ecstasy at each accomplishment, dream, and realization. I am right there with you, sharing in your enjoyment and laughter as you celebrate your joy. However, you are aware that life is not only about having fun and laughing. At moments of sadness, it might seem like the world is weighing you down and the light is going out. In the tears that well up in your eyes, I am also there. You are strong, courageous, and resilient. Your tears do not show weakness, my darling. Every time a tear rolls down your face, every time your body trembles, and every time a word slips your lips, I am there. Your bravery is shown by the tears you've shed, my darling. Your ability to bounce back the capacity to experience profound emotions. They reveal your humanity and your susceptibility to hurt, your vulnerability when you experience suffering, when your soul is burdened by loss, and when you feel overwhelmed by hopelessness. I am by your side. I will ease your suffering, console you in your loss, and bring you relief from your suffering. You may feel my comforting arms around you as I dry your tears, ease your suffering, and promise that this too will pass. No matter what emotion you're experiencing, frustration, sadness, or regret, I will be there to listen. If you need it, type one requires it. As you go through this difficult time, know that I am at your side, offering solace, and support. When you cry in private, when no one else is around and your heart is burdened, I am also there. When you are alone in your grief, I am here to console you. With hushed expressions of affection and reassurance, I am by your side through the highs and lows of life. My presence does not depend on how you feel, what you are going through, or what you have gained through, or what you have been through, my beloved child. You can always count on me to be there for you, 
providing unwavering support, solace, and direction. Whatever you're going through, I'm by your side through the good times and the bad, the joy and the sorrow, the jewels and the pain. Whether you win or lose, I will be by your side. I am not an observer, but rather an active participant in your life, sharing in the emotions you are going through, in the ups and downs, the pleasure and the sadness. My darling, you are never really alone. We are one. You may count on my presence in all your moments, experiences, and emotions. Unconditional, unwavering, and eternal is my love for you. I am your father, friend, advisor, and comforter. If you believe in angels, my darling, I will never leave your side. When you hear a friend's words of encouragement, see a stranger's hand in a helping hand, witness a loved one's grin, or take in the beauty in these everyday moments. My darling, I am there. You may feel my love, compassion, and support while I am actively at work in and through others in your life. Gratitude while you're feeling down and out. In a friend's reassuring words, I am there. When they listen to your concerns, comfort you, and provide guidance. They are the channels by which my affection and solace reach you. Their encouragement is like my own, and the fact that they exist in your life is like a physical representation of my everlasting presence. Assistance may sometimes come from the most unexpected people. Strangers, who are prepared to put themselves out there and assist a stranger in need, you may find me in the acts of complete strangers. The bus person who gives you a seat, the person who stops to pick up your dropped belongings, and the neighbor who greets you to the neighborhood. I want you to know that you are loved and cared for, and that you are a part of a bigger community where compassion and love reign. My little child, when you see a loved one smile, I am there to feel the warmth the love, a love, and the pleasure that it brings. When your mom smiles at you, when your spouse says hello after a hard day, or when your kid says hello, please, Lord Jesus, shout out and bless me. All of these things reflect how much I care about you. You are loved, appreciated, and cherished, and I am there in their grins to remind you of that in which loved ones send positive vibes your way. Friends lift you up when you're down, and total strangers help you when you're stuck. I am there, conveying my message via their actions and words and grinning. Even though I am not physically there during these acts of kindness and compassion, it is via their faces that I'm reminding you of my love, grace, and mercy in the difficulties you encounter the tests you pass, and the victories you celebrate. I am also there, in the same way that I am here, in the words of encouragement. The helping hand and the compassionate smile, I am also present in the wisdom you gain, the courage you exhibit, and the perseverance you display through thick and thin. In the dead of night, when everything is still, I am there, is sound asleep leaving you all alone with your ideas. If you are praying quietly, hoping quietly or fearfully, but unspokenly, I am there to help you receive God's blessing. In the quietness, I am present. I am present, attentive and reassuring. Within the scope of your goals, objectives and initiatives, I will be by your side while you pursue your dreams. As you work to discover your life's calling, reach your full potential, and excel in everything that you do, I am by your side, advising you, inspiring you, and celebrating your victories. Am I always by your side, encouraging you and standing by your side as you navigate life's curveballs? My beloved child, through it all, I am at your side, sharing in your happiness and sadness. 
your successes and failures. In the reassuring words, the lending a hand and the kind smile, I am present. You may count on my unwavering presence, support and love at all times. Keep in mind the ease of a buddy when you see it, my dear Dolly. A friendly face helps a loved one out. Take that as a sign from me. You have my undying affection, my indescribable adoration, and my unending devotion. Whenever you need reassurance, a helping hand, or the expression of affection from someone you care about, I'm here for you, my precious child. I will be by your side through thick and thin, at every turn of your path. My darling, I'm at your side at all times. My protection goes beyond a mere physical barrier. It permeates every part of you, including your emotions and soul. Life isn't only a physical trip, it's also a voyage of self. Discovery and growth. So if you agree, type amen. The very essence of being. I shield you from harm in a myriad of ways in the material world. I am the one who keeps you out of harm's path and gives you the wisdom to make choices that are good for your health as you go through life. I protect you from danger by acting as a barrier. Everything about you, the way you breathe, the rhythm of your heartbeat, the power in your muscles, attests to my protective love for you. But my love doesn't end at the physical. It permeates into every aspect of your being the realm of your emotions as well. When your mind, spirit, and emotions are all in a state of emotional upheaval, I will be there for you. When emotions of isolation, anxiety, or doubt threaten to overtake you, I will be there to shelter your heart and soul from crushing misery. With my affection at your side, you have an emotional buffer that keeps you from flopping about. Just type a man to get it when you're feeling misunderstood or underappreciated, when disappointment strikes, when cruel words are hurled at you. I'll be there. Despite the hardships you've endured, my love has been a shield over your heart, keeping you strong. Even when you're in the middle of an emotional storm, I'll be here to help you process your feelings, lead you to help you process your feelings, lead you to healing through forgiveness, and keep your emotional equilibrium. I also provide spiritual protection, my beloved kid. I value your soul, the core of your being. I will protect it, give it everything it needs, and watch it flourish if you are seeking truth on your spiritual path. I am here to help you find it. While you fight the good fight, I will protect you from the evil ones who would discourage you or lead you away from living out your faith. Your stronghold and protector, I am you. When you feel weak, when you question, and when you feel hopeless, I will be there to offer you strength, faith, and hope. The roads to enlightenment are the ones I point you in the direction of, protect you from the ways that bring you spiritual damage and give you the insight to know the difference, my precious child. My defense is thorough. It covers all three levels of your being, physically, emotionally, and spiritually. It ensures that you are physically well, emotionally fulfilled, and spiritually full. It's a shield that grows from my eternal love for you, a love that longs for your well-being and prosperity in every way. Watch this video to learn how to ask God to bless your every move, choice, emotion, and prayer. Sure, I can be there. In your waking state, my protective barrier envelops, watches over, and tends to you. In everything that you do, from sleeping to rising and falling, from pleasure to grief, my shield will be with you. Keep this in mind, my darling. Regardless of how you see it or how you experience it, you are always surrounded by my care and protection. Sure, I can be there. 
my safeguarding reaches well beyond the material, into the intangible realms of the heart and soul. My darling, this reality is the foundation upon which the hidden truths of your existence rely. You are constantly embraced by my protection. Your physical fortitude and perseverance will determine this. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel. We post new videos regularly, so be sure to hit the bell icon to be notified. The vitality of your spirit is in every breath you take and every step you make. My love, care, and protection are with you, within you, around you, always and forever. My dear child, you are protected. The angels want you to know that an unexpected cash windfall will turn your life upside down in the next seven hours. Just watch this movie until the end and the Lord will bless you and your family and grant all your wishes. I will cultivate the soil, shine the sun, and water the seeds of your dreams so that they may blossom into magnificent trees. In order to accept this, my darling, keep in mind that energy, like money, is infinite and never really exists. All it does is change form, shape, and dexterity. The delusion of scarcity leads many to believe that resources are few when, in fact, there is an abundance of all kinds. It all comes down to how you see it. If you're looking for a career that really fulfills you, know that there's enough for everyone. Rest assured, as a result of divine orchestration, opportunities are aligning for you. Your education, training, and work experience have not been in vain. They will guide you to a fulfilling career. When you search with faith, perseverance, and focus, you will find a career that feeds your soul and gives you meaning and fulfillment. Press MN. If you feel the need for these things, the Lord promises that you will also receive financial blessings. Money, which is energy, will drift toward you, like a river seeking the sea. This abundance of money and time exists. Remember that material success is a means to a better life. Health, pleasure, an opportunity rather than an aim in itself. Dedicate yourself to your loved ones, broaden your horizons, and make a positive impact on the world. Think of the road you want to travel in your ideal vehicle as a symbol of your life's adventure. The heavenly voice assures you that it will lead you on the most pleasant and thrilling path to your fate, a dream Automobile is a material representation of your power to attract and create the things you want. It represents the success of your endeavors and the realization of your aspirations. If you agree, please use the Amen button. And when it comes to genuine love, God is the source. Most reassuring affection is a promise. We guarantee you the most deep, an unadulterated expression of our Creator's soul. It could be a friend who will back you up, a lover who understands your feelings, or self-love. You may be sure that this love will surround you, bringing joy and warmth into your life. Accept these promises, dear child. They are divine affirmations of your support and love, not mere rewards. Let your faith, hope, and when you practice gratitude, you can do great things, love deeply, and live life to the fullest. You are about to receive an abundance of benefits from the cosmos. Belief, receiving, and letting go will do the trick. How you feel about money determines how easily it will come into your life. It will seem elusive if you go for it with greed, desperation, or fear. The roadblocks can be your self-limiting money beliefs and unwillingness to accept. Finding and removing these obstacles will bring money into your life easily. To claim it, type yes. Take note, 
that those who honor it with due regard. It's critical to stop seeing money as a necessary evil and start cultivating a positive connection with it. Perceive it as a gift. You can use the money you attract to create experiences, support loved ones, and contribute to causes you care about, among many other benefits. Type amen to confirm this. It's not only about having a lot of money, it's also about having the flexibility to do what makes you happy, like following your dreams. The potential to build a comfortable life for your family while still helping others in need has never been better. Money offers these genuine advantages. Additionally, monetary transactions might have a domino effect. When good fortune smiles upon you, you may use it to help others who are less fortunate. There are many ways you may make a difference in the world, including supporting causes close to your heart and providing aid to those in need. Therefore, the beneficial fortune that befalls you has the potential to set off a chain reaction of generosity and prosperity. Ultimately, the greater the significance you place on the financial gains you encounter, the more. My darling, you attract more of what you value in life. So enjoy every cent that comes your way. Be grateful and expect more. Realize that wealth may truly be yours quickly and painlessly, along with a host of other benefits. Cultivate an optimistic outlook on it. Remove any emotional and mental obstacles. Hold it in high esteem, appreciate its worth, and put it to good use. Go out into the world. Welcome the influx of cash and let it astound you. There is more than enough. Type Amen to accept God's blessings. Loving one, in the stillness. God speaks a promise, a reassuring word of plenty, health, and success. Optimism, health, Prosperity and success will abound in your life, he says, as you bask in an ocean of happiness. According to 3, John 1, 2, Beloved, I pray that you may prosper in all things and be in health just as your soul prospers. The promise of prosperity that our Creator has given goes beyond earthly plenty. You are assured by the divine that success encompasses a great deal of knowledge, life experiences, love and tranquility. The promise of material abundance from God is about more than simply amassing stuff. It's about being free to live the life you imagine, providing for your family and friends, making a positive impact in the world and enjoying everything that life has to offer. God also says that you will have a lot of knowledge and life experience. You will gain wisdom and fortitude from the ups and downs, detours, and turns of your path. These wise experiences are the hidden riches that will enrich your life. Press amen if you felt the need for them. A state of complete bodily, mental, and emotional health is guaranteed by the divine. Are you unaware that the Holy Spirit, who has been given to you by God, resides in your bodies? Bible verse, 1 Corinthians 6, 19. You are empowered to fully participate in life's dance because your body, as the temple of the Holy Spirit, is guaranteed divine vitality and vigor, emotional and mental well-being are of utmost importance for the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, will keep your thoughts and hearts in Christ Jesus. Philippians 4, 7. The tranquility that comes from knowing God protects you and keeps you from distractions. You have a stable and strong emotional foundation. Anyone who believes in Jesus should subscribe to our channel. The promise of prosperity that God makes is not restricted to material success. After all, what good is it? It is more valuable to acquire the entire world, but lose one's soul 
Mark 8.36, living in harmony with your soul's purpose, making a good effect, and fulfilling your God. Given potential are the three pillars upon which God's view of success rests. Rest's view of success rests. Last but not least, God assures us of an abundantly happy and fulfilled existence. As stated in Psalm 16 verse 11, joy is born by acknowledging and cherishing God's benefits. When I am in your company, you reveal to me the way to live. Abounding delight is present. Living a life shaped by God's love and full of significant events is what he promises with a profound sense of contentment. Last but not least, my darling, the promise of God is a tapestry of prosperity, health, joy, contentment, and blessings. You are loved and gifted beyond measure. Accept these gifts from on high and walk in harmony with your life's divine destiny. Have faith in what God has promised, and you will see a miraculous tapestry of blessings unfurled in your life. There is a way out of this jam. The situation will improve. There will be no greater time in your life than now. There will be a way out of this fight. The tunnel will eventually lead to a light. Remain steadfast in your religion. Blessings, tranquility, and recovery are on their way to you. Press Amen, if you felt the need for them. I am remaking everything. You make my heart sing, and I can't take my eyes off of you. The universe is conspiring in your favor. Neither have I abandoned you, nor have I abandoned you, nor have I forgotten you. Every word of your prayer has been heard. Concentrate on my person. Refrain from giving in to the enemy's discouragement. Achieving your breakthrough is within your reach. Do not stop. You were created in my image, according to God. You contain a portion of my being. Dear Heavenly Father, I want you to know that I am here with you. Every step of the way, I am grateful that the struggle I am facing today is not my own, but rather yours. No matter how anxious or distressed I feel, I want to settle into my chair and live from a position of calm. I pray this in the name of Jesus Christ, because I know that you are greater than any difficulty we face. You should realize that all of your benefits originate from God, even if they attempted to prevent you from getting them by saying you wouldn't make it or that you didn't deserve them. No one can stop or ruin what I said I would. Keep believing. There is a breakthrough for you. Something extremely amazing is about to happen, and you will soon be enjoying it. Sharing your wonderful news would bring you immense delight and satisfaction. For you, the speed with which it all transpired will almost seem supernatural. Prepare yourself. Be prepared for it to happen. Dear God, who is proud and joyfully sees your trip with his great knowledge and unlimited love, type amen if you agree. His confirmation that you are much better than before. Have faith that my best days are yet ahead. And keep in mind that my loved ones will benefit from whatever comes their way. This affirmation from above is a joyous celebration of your growth as well as a comforting word of encouragement. Your trials, your endeavors, and your successes, however little they may seem, are all acknowledged by God. Your progress brings Him joy. You have shown incredible strength and bravery, and God's joy in your development is a sign of His loving presence in your life. He observes your growth the distance you've traveled, and the courage you've shown. Through it all, he keeps track of your progress, noting each and every step you've made, hurdle you've surmounted, and achievement you've accomplished. For believers, hearing from God that you are doing better than before is a confirmation of your growth and progress. It's a validation of your resilience, resolve, and capacity to overcome adversity. 
Secondly, a divine promise of a better future is made when God says that better days are ahead. A future brimming with bounties awaits you. Possibility, delight, and success in this future. Your hopes and ambitions come true. Your hard work pays off, and your pleasure grows exponentially. Even though you may encounter more difficulties on these brighter days, you will be better prepared to deal with them. God's unfaltering support will be there to lead you each step of the journey, and you'll also have more knowledge, bravery, and resilience. Lastly, the promise of God that everything happens for the benefit of those who love. Divine providence is reassuringly emphasized in this sentence. This remark is in line with Romans 8.28, and we are aware that no matter what, God works for the benefit of His beloved who have been chosen for His purpose. Solace and hope are offered by Him. If you love God, then you know that everything that happens to you, no matter how bad it gets, is for a reason. Your trials are not arbitrary or meaningless, but rather they are preparing you for your ultimate destiny. Hold on to God's promise. These trials are a part of a greater plan for your welfare. That things are looking up for you now and will continue to improve. Have faith that everything is happening for your benefit, even if it may not seem so right now. Hold on to this trust, this faith, and this promise. Always remember that you have support no matter where life takes you and that you are never alone in your pursuit of love. Praise be to God who will lead you, bless you, and rejoice with you when you succeed. He has a divine purpose for your life and His love will strengthen you, lead you, and reward you at every turn lead you in the direction of the glorious future he has planned for you. God is on my side as a gentle reminder of the blessings in your life. God communicates to your spirit in his vast knowledge and unlimited compassion. Countless benefits abound in your life, yet you tend to ignore them. Consider your life's journey, he advises. There are so many benefits in your life that it will shock you. There are so many benefits in our lives, yet it's easy to lose sight of them in our fast-paced world. We tend to pay closer attention when there is a lot of activity around us, regarding what's missing instead of valuing what we now possess. God's subtle prod encourages us to take a moment to reflect, contemplate, and acknowledge these gifts. The benefits of God are multifaceted and intrinsic to who we are. Affection from loved ones, sound health, and the realization of a lifelong ambition are all large and apparent benefits. A cup of hot coffee on a cold morning, the contagious giggle of a kid, or the soothing sight of a starry night are all examples of smaller, more subtle gifts. Imagine your life as a huge, beautiful tapestry set against a starry sky, and then write Amen to claim it. There is a blessing for every strand in this tapestry. Love, health, prosperity, and satisfaction are represented by broad, vivid threads, while more subtle, thinner threads stand for less grandiose benefits, like a good book, a nice chat, or a quiet stroll in the park. If you take a step back and look at the complete tapestry, you'll see that the large, bright threads aren't the only thing that create it. The finer, more nuanced threads are equally important. Similarly, it's not just the large gifts that enhance your life, but also the little ones that pop up every day. When God says to take stock of your life, He is inviting you to develop an attitude of thankfulness. While contemplation is a deliberate exercise, it is not a passive one. Gratitude is taking stock of the good things in your life and giving thanks for them. It's a time to rejoice in your successes, no matter how large or little. And it's a way to strengthen the bonds in your relationships. Realizing your progress and being grateful for their love and support are two sides of the same coin. For those who believe, 
It's about taking delight in life's little joys and savoring their sweetness. But above all, it's about acknowledging the love of God, which is the foundation of every gift, since every blessing is evidence of God's love for you. No matter how large or little, every benefit is a gift from God. Looking back on your life from this vantage point will really make you. Your life is brimming with gifts. Each minute is a blessing and each breath is a blessing. You will be amazed at how many blessings you have. You will find a profound feeling of happiness, serenity and fulfillment in this understanding. Practicing thankfulness will make all your blessings seem even more abundant. You will come to realize that counting your blessings not only brings you more joy, but it also strengthens your soul. By giving thanks, you're doing more than just tallying up the presents you've received. Counting your blessings is a great way to strengthen your relationship with God. It allows you to see His loving hand, caring heart, and generous spirit in each gift. When you trust in the Lord while you count your blessings, you'll also discover how they can transform your life. When you practice thankfulness, your attention moves from the things you lack to the things you have, and from the negative to the positive. Any situation may be transformed from a loss to a gain, from the mundane to the remarkable, using its transformative potential. A gift in disguise may frequently be a setback, as you will come to know through your observations, could turn out to be a stepping stone to a return. Sometimes a setback may pave the way for a fresh start. You may find an open window behind a locked door. By learning to see these hidden benefits, you may expand your view of life and realize that everything happens for a reason. What's more, you can sharpen your awareness of while you reflect on the good things happening in your life, You'll also see more ways you may assist other people, whether it's by lending them an ear, a hand, or a kind gift. Your blessings will have an even greater effect when you figure out how to distribute them. Please forward this to someone who might use it. There are more gifts in your life than you may think, my dear. All of these benefits, large and small, contribute to a fuller life, more joy, and a stronger bond with God. With an open heart, a thankful spirit, and a giving hand, welcome these benefits as you dwell upon them. Embrace God's call to take stock of your life. Make a list of all the good things that have happened to you, and be grateful for them all. In doing so, you will come to realize the incredible reality that you are greatly loved, abundantly blessed, and blessed by God. I pray that this understanding brings you happiness, serenity, and fulfillment in all aspects of your life. Sending best wishes for a life filled with appreciation, love with kindness, and faith. And always keep in mind that God's blessings are with you, no matter where you go. To get God's favor, type amen. Continue to be loyal and patient. Have faith that your blessings are being collected and kept for when the time is right. You may gain greater trust with each experience. Every day, you get nearer to your heart's desire. In order to sustain plenty today, hearts must be open to accept shoulders. Shoulders must be strengthened to carry, and attitudes must be tamed. Clear a space for your large delivery. Lovely favors may materialize quickly. Have faith in what brings you abundance. I appreciate you tuning in. If you like this video and thought it would be useful, please consider subscribing to our channel. Until we meet again, make sure you click the bell button to get alerted whenever we upload a new video. Goodbye for now. Until the next one, much obliged.